Philip Anzugira made carpentry his profession when he couldn't find work as a mechanic. He can't afford to rent a workshop, so he works at the roadside in a suburb of Nairobi. Wood and tools are costly in Kenya. Anzugira used to ask customers to pay in advance. That's changed since he started using the Mshwari mobile credit service. Mshwari, it's a good experience. Like for small businesses yeah, where you, you don't have to go to the bank, they give you money directly, then you pay it back. An attractive offer for Kenyans with little income and easy to handle. You only need a phone. So whenever Philip Anzugira has some earnings, he stops at a neighborhood branch of his mobile Zero, seven, provider. One, as soon as he deposits some money, he can borrow up to double that amount. The money is debited to his mobile phone account. When I'm paying back my loan, I need to pay with an extra amount. So that where the extra amount is taken from, after you pay a loan, they just take the loan amount and then the extra amount is sent back to your account. Interest on the loan is 7%. For small businesses, it's the only way to get loans. Banks charge even higher rates. With the mobile credit system, Philip Anzugira can now stock up on timber for his orders. Mobile phone operator Safaricom introduced the Mshwari credit service three years ago, and it now has some 14 million customers. The average uh, loan size that is dispersed uh, to these top customers on Mshwari is in the region of 1,700 to 2,000 shillings. So they're, really, they're micro loans. 2,000 shillings equal roughly 18 euros. For years, Kenya's banks ignored the microloan sector until mobile phone operators proved that it can be very profitable. Their competitors are now trying to set up rival microloan systems. This could eventually lead to cheaper loans throughout Kenya, which could in turn boost economic growth. If I can make that loan to you over the phone, very low transaction costs, suddenly I've got a different dynamic. So we've had this, uh, we've had this uh, uh, renaissance of credit that has come through the mobile phone. And it's, I think people still have not properly estimated its value and the boost it's giving the economy. Today, Philip Anzugira is one of 14 million Mshwari users in Kenya. A lot of his friends and family members in rural areas also use the service. It's becoming essential for people on low incomes.